Michael, just talk a little bit about your, your second year here and, and what you're looking to gain out of these four days, both as a as a counselor and as a, as a sponge, so to speak, kind of trying to gather as much information as well. Yeah, no, it's awesome, um, especially to be in the presence of, you know, so much talent. Um, just with the Mannings, the other college quarterbacks that are here, um, I think there's a lot of knowledge that can be gained. Um, and then just to get to be with the kids and uh, really get to experience that and mentor them and coach them and see, you know, what excites them. Because obviously as a quarterback, you know, I've been in their same role where they're at when they were when I was a young kid. Um, so just kind of getting them and trying to show them the right steps going forward and, you know, let them have some fun with it is really cool. Last year was not the year you wanted from a lot of fronts, I guess, starting with the hurricane and it just uh, it, it, it continued from there. Uh, do, do you feel like 2022 is almost a, a fresh start for you and your teammates this year? Yeah, I think so. Um, you know, we're, we're pushing all that, everything last year behind us from the hurricane, um, the season we had and whatnot. You know, we've kind of flushed that down the drain. And, you know, we've had a great spring, obviously, with a new offensive coordinator um, who everybody loves. Uh, so he's changed up the dynamic of the offense just a little bit. Um, so got a couple transfers in, just the morale of the whole team and the energy and the, the chemistry is really built this whole spring and summer going forward. What are your goals for 2022? Really just be the best leader I can be. Um, you know, the main goal for me is, you know, I don't really care what I do, but if I can lead my team and we can win a bunch of ball games, that's a successful season to me. Best of luck this year. Thanks. Thank you, sir. Appreciate you.